Well, I'll tell you what, guys. We had an awesome day out here Today with Salty awesome. Tail. Today was awesome. We had a good time. We got a lot of fish. We throw back a lot of fish. Yeah. We run like crazy. What species did we catch today? Well, we got dolphin. We got black belly rosses. We have. guys and welcome back to Salty Sportsman. This week we're doing something a little bit different. I took a little night trip. Actually I left at like 3 o'clock in the morning. I headed out of Anna Marie Island all the way down to Fort Lauderdale. I say all the way down but it's only like three hours. <laughs> Wasn't a bad drive but I'm here with the ninja. The ninja baby. He actually has a YouTube channel too, Salty Tales. And I will put the link in the description below so make sure to go check that out. But today, I'm starting off my day with Cuban coffee for the very first time. Ah, now I got that Cuban coffee in there. <laughs> that will wake you up, man. Yeah, it will. Time to go catch some mahi, baby. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we kind of slowed down for a second. I just had to show you guys something. We're literally... You can see land behind us, right? How close that is? This is the water depth right here. Yes, that was 700 feet of water or 630 feet of water. That's one of the reasons why I love fishing in Fort Lauderdale. Oh, fish, fish, fish. Oh, that looked good. Come on, baby. It's a mahi, it's a mahi. Woo! Fish on, fish on! Woo! There's a good one. That's a decent one. Yeah. guys so what we're doing we just hooked up on the troll we got two peanuts to the boat we just released them um, both fun little fish but we what we found when we were trolling on this we're, we're not really trolling a weed line we're we're trolling really scattered weed patches and what we're doing here is uh we're gonna go back to the weed patch that we saw we saw two big weed patches and we're gonna throw some chunk bait out there just kind of switch it up a little bit we've been trolling for a little while we only got two little peanuts and now we found this giant weed patch and we're about to throw chunk bait and see what happens. Got a mahi right here. Oh yeah, mahi on. There's a whole school of them down here, bro. Yep. Nice. Woo! I'm gonna 
down to Japan. to them man yeah Woo! our first keeper mahi today we're just kind of oh shoot i'm so sorry <laughs> i'm sorry man it's all right bro you have to watch the boat after oh man <laughs> all right so what we're doing here guys is we found a crate in the water so now we're throwing just little uh just little jigs to catch the little bar jack and we found out that the mahi um, they're just little peanuts. We're catching little mahi. They're really finicky. So we thought about it and we're like, you know what? They'll probably like the fresh bait better. So we started cutting up the little bar jack for bait. Little jacks right off the, right off the crate and it's been working. couple peanuts we drifted a few times kind of switched gears and tried to see if we can get on some better mahi that didn't work so what we're doing is switching gears and he's actually showing me a different type of fishing I've never done in my life I grew up in Fort Lauderdale I've never deep dropped before Daiwa Tenacam 1000 never even heard of it probably because I'm not into deep dropping but this is my first time ever doing it stay tuned in guys it's gonna be exciting there we are. Okay guys, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna deep drop because those mahi are not calculating at all. They're being bad guys, man. And I don't like that thing. We try everything with them. They're really, really finicky, so. Yeah, they're being stubborn. It's the beginning yeah. of the season though, so. It's the beginning of the season. They are not really, they are not eating. So we're gonna switch gears. We're gonna go deep dropping with an eight six pounder. This is an eight six pounder. And let's see what happens. Hey, we got our first fish deep dropping. This is actually the first fish I've ever seen caught deep dropping in person. It's pretty cool. Check it out, guys. This is a black belly Rossi. It's a really nice fish and it's called black belly. Look inside. That thing is dark. Yeah, it is. Look at those eyes. It's a beautiful fish. It is a beautiful fish. It's uh, This is pretty much an adult already. It does, they don't grow a lot bigger than this. But look at those eyes, man. It's beautiful. Man, that's beautiful. These guys, I tell everybody, for you guys to know, this is the best ceviche you will ever have in your life. This is lemon, a little bit of onion, that's it, man. That's all you need. It's I, freaking awesome. I can't wait. All right, guys, we got another fish on. This rod is bending, as you can see behind me. What you got for us? Baby, I'm excited. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> This is our second one. <laughs> that's a nice fish right there, brother. That's beautiful. Brother, I can tell you this. That's, that's the biggest uh, blackberry rock I ever had. Nice. That's a good one. That's a good one. I'm lifting them just like a bass. Yep. That's the way to do it. All right. We got another fish on here. Possibly two fish. 
like I said guys, this is my first time ever deep dropping. He's teaching me how to do it. It's a pretty cool deal. Uh, you obviously have to have specialty gear. This is an electronic reel and uh, it's on its way to being up right now. But Those are meters guys. Those numbers over there are meters, they're not feet. Wow, that thing was down there, about a thousand feet, huh? So you, you get that number and you multiply it by three and it's gonna give you how many feet you have now. Bigger one? Oh my gosh! Yeah! This is a freaking monster! Uh, look at this monster guys beautiful fish guys I know I said before that the other one we got was the biggest one I got this one is the biggest one I got <laughs> this is the biggest one bro this is crazy this is, is huge look how beautiful that fish is guys gosh what a beautiful I mean look at the colors such vibrant colors in this look thing. at those eyes man those eyes can see everything look at that man that's awesome I'm getting excited here, buddy. Yeah. Look at that rod. He's bending, brother. Whoa. That's good for deep dropping, right? Hell yeah. A bent rod's always good, but that thing is bending. Oh, look, that's a look, good fish. Look at that real suffering. Woo! We got a triple! Woo! Dude, that is awesome. <laughs> Man, those things are gorgeous. Look at it, baby. Wow. I'm huge. Yeah, pretty big for their normal size. That's good. What it what is there like a leak? What's the legal game? Or is it they have no size? No size, no, not uh no limit. No limit. guys we had an awesome day out here today with salty awesome. tail today was awesome we had a good time we got a lot of fish we throw back a lot of fish yeah we run like crazy what species did we catch today well we got dolphin we got black belly rosses and we, we saw a, good... a lot of fish we didn't really target one species on this trip um, today we went out there with really no direct plan we just wanted to go out there, catch some fish, have t have some fun, meet each other. We never met each other yeah. until this morning, and we got the opportunity to meet each other. We had a great time out there on the water. Hey, thanks for bringing me. Thank you for coming, bro. The ninja brought me out and put me on fish. Woo! Such appreciated. Hey, Thank guys, you if you guys enjoyed this episode, please be sure to hit that subscribe button. Hit and, it. Yeah, and hit it. And don't forget, I put the link to Ninja Man's YouTube channel right in the description of my channel, so please be sure to check that out, and I'll see you next time. Love you.